hello everyone today we are going to study a new type of a chart which is called as a racing bar chart as you can see on the screen uh, a chart is working animatedly and it's a bar chart it's uh, called as a racing bar chart or it's called as a running bar chart a racing bar chart is a bar chart which will be created with the help of our rank values and will be denoting and will be visualizing you various uh, fields on the behalf of the ranks that which one have a highest rank which one have the lowest rank and the one which will be having highest rank will be coming on the top the one which will be having a least rank will be coming on the at the last and it will be working according to the uh, order date or we can say working according to the date field and will be changing the ranks for the uh, items for which we are creating the chart so this was this was the uh, racing bar chart uh, racing bar chart is also called as a running bar chart also as you can see on the x-axis of it we have a running totals and y-axis we have a ranks now what we'll, be, what we'll be doing we'll be creating this type of a chart and we'll be studying that how we can create it so for this first of all we have taken the data set of the global superstore and we'll be create trying to create now a bar chart which is a racing bar chart so I'm mentioning in my field that we are creating a racing bar chart for customer name according to sales according to sales before creating a racing bar chart for x-axis we need running total and for y-axis we need rank values and for rank and for running total we both of the fields needs to be a mayor so that is why I had kept some sales on columns and some sales on rows and the chart which will be created will be called as a uh, scatter plot and will be having only one plot of it now on x-axis I am again and again telling you that on x-axis it should be a running total so I am right clicking on my columns tab and going to click table calculation and it should be running total this running total should be taken as the percent of total so we'll be going to add new secondary calculation and we'll be going to percent of total you can see on the x-axis now it is from 0 to 100 percent whereas y-axis running total will be working for the rank values y-axis will be rank so we'll be going to click table calculation and making it rank here you can see it is from 0 to 2 and it will become a rank value now this running total and this rank we are working uh, for customer name so what we'll be doing we'll be dragging customer name and keeping over to the colors so all the customer name will be coming here now as all these customers which we are showing here will be ranked according to the customers names will be ranked according to the sum sales so we'll be telling that that our rank field should be working according to the customer name hence these type of the customer this type of a chart will be created but for creating a racing bar chart what we need to do is uh, one of the element for which we are creating a bar chart will be a discrete in nature it is either x-axis will be discrete or y-axis will be discrete here what we are doing is we are creating our x-axis a discrete element and so what we are mentioning it we are keeping it as discrete automatically a bar chart will be created this bar chart here is not telling you so much of the things so what we'll be doing is we are keeping customer name at the text and will be telling me that the one which has a rank one this his name is Tom Ashbrook so this data is according to the total uh, we can say total values and according to this Tom Ashbrook is the one which has the highest rank now uh, what we need is we need to find the what's the highest value of the sales so we have dropped the sales over here also and uh, now we need to see not according to the total value we need to see according to the every month uh, for the different years so we are dragging this order date over the pages and pages is a shelf in the tableau which will be showing you uh, which will be giving you the option of uh, animation so you can see when I have dragged year over date over here so it is coming as a ribbon here in the right side uh, and here in right side it is showing me the features like stop button play button rewind and these are the speed levels but what I am doing is I am converting my year order date to the month level so that I can check it for every month when, uh, which customer is getting the rank one as total uh, amount of sales will be done more amount of sales will be done by Tom Ash group but not in every month so when we are talking about the every month that person will be getting changed 
and then I am annotating on my data and I am mentioning here that I want to see page name in annotation I am highlighting it and giving the font size is 48 bold so it will be coming like this I have to align it correctly after aligning it will be coming like this now most of them my task is done I am getting it to entire view but it is not so good so it is like fine like this and then I am going to presentation view now you can see our bar chart is created a racing bar chart but it is not getting uh, animation or we can say we can say that it is not running so for running it we have to click here and my racing bar chart will be start running so this is the racing bar chart here in which bars are getting running uh, and uh, uh, left side will be uh, your y-axis it will be rank according to rank it is running and every month you can see in March 2013 the person is different May 2003 it is different Logan and July 2003 the person that is Peter so and every month the rank one person is getting changed with this we can analyze that uh, we can reach to inside that every month there is not a same person who is getting a rank one according to the sales every one person is diff getting different so according to it we can give different type of a discount to the person who is getting the rank one so that next month might be he will be getting the same, the same person who will be getting again the same rank thanks so this was about my uh, racing bar chart for which we have studied now